Luna, someone on Instagram is impersonating me. Huh? Barbara. I literally, I'm so shocked because never in my life did I ever think that I would get to a point where somebody can take pictures of me. I mean, when they do it to other people, that's like, that's normal, that's fine. But me, this is not a movie. I said catfish in play. You? <laughs> it took so much for me to not go on the Instagram stories and say this entire thing and, and tell you my shop. But let me read you some of the stories that I have. Sorry. Uh, today, I'm going to be an alleged model. Hello, welcome to my channel. I promise you. Usually things, I say this every vlog, but usually things are not this chaotic. I promise. Like, in real life, my life is not this chaotic. It is the morning of my photo shoot. Uh, this is technically my first paid modeling gig. I am going to be a face model. <laughs> um, so for breakfast, I'm going to have mince and basmati rice that I made myself with obviously orange juice in a wine glass. <laughs> Let me grab one of these. I still haven't packed the dishes. I haven't packed the dishes yet, but <laughs> my dad's not home, so I can pack them whenever I want to. Okay, that's a lot. Anyway, so I am modeling fine, whatever, that's okay. And I thought I was gonna start this vlog super aesthetically, you know, you seeing me brush my teeth. I did a whole thing, like I was supposed to like come up from the mirror and you were gonna see me and it was just gonna be this whole cute thing. And then while I was doing my hair, curling my hair, on the phone with a friend of mine, let me tell you what happened, okay? This part is very embarrassing and I don't expect you to be focused on this part of the story. I need you to focus on the fact that someone is catfishing people using my pictures, but, okay? I'm on the phone with my friend. Uh, she's like telling me how like, she, I must go confess to my crush that I like him and all of these things. And I was like, listen, I could never confess. I would rather die than confess. And women are not supposed to shoot their shots. If your crush can't see that you are a big deal, that you are literally a divine goddess, your crush doesn't deserve you. And that's just how I feel about these things. So, <laughs> so we're talking about this and she's like, no, dude, I promise you, he likes you too. Have you seen, have you seen? And I'm like, no, no, he doesn't. No, no, he doesn't. So we're arguing back and forth and I'm like, he literally stopped watching my Instagram stories. She's like, I don't believe you. I'm like, I'm gonna prove it to you. I'm gonna go inside my Instagram stories. So I go inside my Instagram stories just to like scroll through and see if he viewed my story, which, well, to be fair, I didn't go through all of them. But in my head, like, if he did view them, they'd probably be higher up in the stories. But that's not the point. The point is, as I'm scrolling down, I see my face. But, I mean, I view my own stories to make sure that I didn't say anything crazy. But I'm not me viewing my stories. Do you know what I mean? Like, I, I don't, my, <laughs> like, this was literally what I was going through. I'm like panicking, losing my mind, and this person now stole so much of my time because it's like half past 10 and I need to leave the house at half past 11. Now I spent a good half an hour on the phone with my friends on WhatsApp trying to get people to report and block this account because clearly something is happening and something is going on. So I click on the profile, I go inside the profile, and it's literally just pictures and pictures and pictures of me let me read you one of them hey this one says uh it's a picture of me and i wasn't even 14 in this picture i was literally 16 this was in grade 10 new year's like january we went and it was my mom and my dad and you know things were still like relatively okay and we were having breakfast together as a family and my mom went to the spa. I literally was standing outside the spa. I remember this day, I took this picture. That's me in the photo. So this is what the caption says. It's like, this isn't a glow up. This is a hashtag got up, lol. Sorry for the corniness, but I'm being honest. When I was 14, I was depressed. Ha! <laughs> when I was, I was happy. When I was 14, I was depressed and just didn't love myself until I discovered Christ and the Holy Name itself. I read all the verses and studied his word and it impacted life 
is so many ways. Now I'm 21, my health is amazing, I work out, I'm beautiful, and so much more is going my way. Angel emoji, haibo, haibo, vaseloid. This one says, who is it? I receive a nasty hate DM and comment about my beliefs and the way I need to wipe this nail polish off my fingers. This is important. Okay, let's, 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 let's be focused girls who multitask, okay? I'm gonna put this in the microwave. And while I put this in the microwave, I'm gonna go grab the acetone so I can wipe the stuff off my fingers. God, help me. I really am going through so much. so important and every time I wash the dishes and don't pack them on time I don't have it in the microwave and I know for a fact the mince is gonna splitter and splatter and who's gonna have to clean the microwave me I don't wanna do that I don't wanna have to clean the microwave I'm in so much shock So basically today I have to go for a photo shoot with Shibe. Y'all know Shibe. Y'all love Shibe. She's the best. <laughs> Where is this acetone? I don't have time for this. <gasps> One thing about acetone, it will disappear. <gasps> this thing was literally like it was it was a lot. I literally left all my hair appliances are just like chilling everywhere my room is looking extra crazy look at that mess on my bed just look at that is that normal it's not normal <laughs> I left everything in such a rush because I was so shocked at what I was witnessing with my eyes but that other post that I was gonna read to you now uh -uh. Where's my laptop? Now I left it inside. But you can read it yourself. The posts are so like ridiculous with such ridiculous captions about stories that I know absolutely nothing about. Why are you making me depressed at the age of 14? I wasn't depressed at 14. Engineering taught me depression, not 14. <laughs> it didn't work like that. I don't know. Like, I think I sh I'm, I'm not shocked. I think I'm like, I think I'm shocked, but more than being shocked, I think I'm like, I'm not scared, but I'm like scared, but I'm not scared because I'm shocked. I, I don't know if that makes sense. Like, it's just a combination of the two emotions. I don't know whether to be shocked or whether to be afraid. And everyone on my WhatsApp is literally just like, no one's taking me seriously. The only people who are taking me seriously are the people on Instagram, which I appreciate. That's why I always say Instagram is so much better than WhatsApp because literally nobody in your WhatsApp context will ever take you seriously. Take it from me. They don't take me seriously. So I post this thing on WhatsApp and they're like, it's the body for me. Everyone's laughing and having a good time about it. Like, wow, that means you're a celebrity, my queen. And then Vuyelwa sends me a message that completely shakes my life. And she's like, well, since you're an influencer now, surely this is going to be happening more often than not. Get ready, my sister. It's your full time asset. Ah! Huh? I've never seen a Tataram baby fake account. Me, I've never seen it. I've never seen it. I'm the, why why Yo. that's literally like that, that's literally so scary it's so scary and it's it's so creepy because like the fact that you go and you're like seek first the kingdom of god i just felt like this was needed today and all of the captions just speak about like god and how i'm a christ conservative chick who posts bikini pictures and has had this she literally like he posts a, a picture of this girl with huge boobs and he's like god milk or she's like i don't even know who it is who's behind it someone dm'd me actually and they were like they went through all of the followers and the the comments and it's all just white people and this person's following only white people so they think it's just a white person who wants to live vicariously through me i mean that's their theory and their conspiracy i'm just shocked like 
white person, black person, doesn't matter what kind of person. Like, for me, my biggest concern is the fact that, like, are you okay? Like, I really hope this person is fine. Like, I hope that after we take down the account, if it's still there, please look for it. If it's still there, please report it. I beg you from the bottom of my heart, report it and take it down. But I'm like... Is this person fine like taking down this account is fine it doesn't change anything because this is someone who's probably going to just go and find someone else to impersonate and take pictures of and use as a you know thing but let's go inside the house my my, my thing is done turn off that i'm so dis disoriented i i actually i can't even recall the last time i was so shocked in my life thumbnail it's these bows they're ruining my life Yo. but in another news my crush hates me he's not viewing my instagram story so <laughs> but more than that um i have to go pick up sipiwe at um the how train station in hatfield and then we have to make our way over to shiba's house i planned to go through my poses because i have to have like five poses ready for the shoot which i have not done Which I haven't done because I, I plan to do it this morning, but obviously a lot of things happened that I wasn't really aware of ready for. Um yeah, but that's literally just the plan for today. Meet up with Sipiwe, do the photo shoots, um, maybe catch coffee afterwards, depending on what time we finish. And then I also want to catch coffee with Seho uh, later on in Kayalami somewhere, Madrid, whatever. Um, so Hatfield, then Kayalami and then i'll probably come back home and yeah that's pretty much it i just want to say though on the topic of the crush because now i'm feeling like super conscious because i feel like i've just confessed my entire secrets to the world first of all i don't have crushes that's not true it's a rumor it's gossip it's a lie i don't have crushes me no i don't crush on people i'll never do that never i think that it's important to acknowledge when people are Okay. Okay. I okay, guess sure. I'm probably gonna have to go and fix this. I think it's important to acknowledge when people are wonderful and beautiful creations, and I have. I don't want a relationship with my crush. That's not what I want. I don't want anything out of it. I just want to crush from a distance and say, "Wow, that's so nice. That's so pretty." But I, I, I don't, I don't, I don't want anything from it. Why? Because I've got several crushes. I've got a crush at school, a crush at church, a crush at work. Uh, not at work because mm, this is work. Do I have a crush on YouTube? Do I have a YouTuber crush? Yeah, I'll be safe. <laughs> it's very seldom that I, I actually have like a real life crush, like a, a serious crush, like one that makes sense. But we'll talk about it, I guess, in a podcast episode. We'll we'll have a podcast episode dedicated to crushes. And I can explain to you the psychology behind how I crush on people because the people that I say are my crushes are not really my crushes because I couldn't care less. I couldn't care a damn. <laughs> but my actual crushes, my real life crushes, are real crushes. And currently, I don't have real crushes right now. Only fake ones. But you wouldn't understand. You're judging me. I can feel it. I'm gonna wrap up this vlog right here. For the house section, I need to pack up my bag. Get extra clothes in case, you know, I don't know. In case what, but... Just pack my bag, get my stuff ready. Get my makeup, foundation, my hair stuff in one bag. So that if anything goes wrong, if maybe she doesn't have my shade. Or if maybe whatever. I don't know what could possibly happen. I can just present it and fix the situation at hand. Um, so I guess I will see you guys once I pick up Simpia from the Khao train station. Outside of that, cheers. Please be safe. People are screenshotting your pictures, which is very scary. Very, very scary. I'm, I'm driving out of Hatfield now, so I didn't pick up Simpia because her Khao train is still in Centurion and i am 30 minutes late it's 29 minutes past 12. my call time was 12 o'clock simpia's call time is quarter past one and i now am the one who is half an hour late because um <laughs> Ooh. 
Yeah, Kala. Y'all know how I feel about punctuality and communication. And such is the fabulous life of Barbara. But anyway, um, on the case of me being impersonated, I got a, a notification, but this was when I was leaving the house, so I didn't really check it. Um, on Instagram about some request that I had made. I'm assuming it's the request to take down the page that I made on Instagram has been approved. I'll check when I get to Sheba's house, but I think I'm not really mad. Oh, there are roadworks. That's why there's traffic, roadworks. I'm not really mad. Um, I don't think I'm scared either. I think I was just shocked. I think that's all that I was experiencing in the morning, like just complete shock because I know that things like these, like this happen um, to people, but I never thought that it would happen to me. I just hope that that person is fine. Like I hope that mentally, emotionally, physically, they are stable and okay, because that's something I don't think a normal person would do that. I, I don't understand why someone would go through such, so much effort. And I think that's what everyone kept saying in the DMs on Instagram is like, this person is going through so much effort. This person has put so much thought into their captions, into everything that they've written. They must be crazy. It is what it is. Like, I'm not really bothered by it. So it's very, we have bigger problems. <laughs> I have bigger problems in life than somebody catfishing people with my picture. Wow. Hello guys. Hi. How were you earlier? Underground. I was underground. Didn't have any network service, but now I'm here. Oh my gosh. Why are you weakened the knees right now? <laughs> Stand up. I'm done. Now it's. Uh, don't worry, I got you. <laughs> she doesn't want to be in the frame. Now it's Simbia's turn. Are you ready? How about this is gonna be your daily life when you grow up? And of course, <laughs> she's not even, she's not even shy, and of course, it's my turn now to go take pictures, so, what shall I do, mm, what, <laughs> okay, I'm not nervous, I'm just like, she was always like, look there, and I'm like, look there, where she been? <laughs> like, every time we take pictures, our friendship almost ends, there's so many days, there are literally so many. She said, Barbara, I need a 45 degree angle. You? And then I'll give her 45. A but she really degree? meant 90 degrees. <laughs> That's no problem. But yes, I'm done. I'm ready for shooting. It's it's my supermodel time. Are you ready? Come on, ready. Damn. Sorry. Yeah. Don't talk to me. Block me on WhatsApp. Block me on Instagram. Block me everywhere. But follow her. <laughs> and get your beat. Get beat. Get. Yeah. I will put it in the, in the below, in the description box. Look at Chibi. <laughs> What's up? Miss, give me a 45 degree angle. Just look, <laughs> look there, Barbara. Look at her. She got like professional everything's there. <laughs> so we're gonna shoot. I'm gonna get naked. You're not gonna see me naked. That's what you're not gonna do. <laughs> and yeah, I guess we can rock. Are we gonna play music today or today? I don't deserve music. <laughs> He deserves the world, baby. Exactly! Exactly! It's giving off duty model. Mm. Yeah. Okay, so the plan today was to go to Hatfield after this and do a res tour, but I'm not really sure that I still want to go to Hatfield to do it. Just because I'm tired. <laughs> really, I am I'm exhausted. I don't have the energy to like go to the street now and like scream and show people an entire res. I don't think I have it in me. After this, I just want to eat. I want to go home. I want to edit this vlog. Shiba, come say hi. They don't know. They don't know you have a personality, guys. This is my friend, and she's so funny. <laughs> they don't know I have a personality. They don't know. But I feel like only shooter. I am a shooter, guys. Mm, but she's also funny. Like and she's funny Jesus. like me. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> I'm kidding. This is awkward. Don't we? What? What do we do? You show personality. <laughs> Anyway, guys, I'm just chilling. Listen, if you, if, if you want to take pictures, like professional pictures, 
but you feel shy and you feel like you don't know what to yeah. do. Come I here. Get you. She's not gonna judge you. I understand you. I will she you. doesn't judge me. <laughs> and I I've been coming here how many times? I still I still panic yeah. every time. And she kills it. Every time. Allegedly. <laughs> <laughs> she was finishing me with her. Do you know that's actually a fact? Well, not really. I can't say it's a fact because I don't yeah. do it on purpose. But I was telling them how I did this personality t- test quick at a gang on Sunday. Yeah. It's part of like the whole leadership thing, whatever. Yeah. And one of the traits that they said I have is I'm afraid of being taken advantage of. So I tried to keep people at like mm. an arm's length. And I was like, huh. I don't mm. know if that's true because I'm open. <laughs> So like you're open in a professional way, oh. but you have boundaries, which is a good thing. Yes, exactly. Yeah. Have boundaries. <laughs> <laughs> Be like me. Have boundaries. I, I thought I, I, I really thought I was just normal. Mm. No. It's just around my friends, I'm a sweetheart, but when I'm outside, I'm normal. I don't know what that means. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what that means, but. <laughs> Beef flavor is really not nice. Don't buy these chips. <laughs> 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 she very must have eaten this thing. What this goes on? But well, guys, by at this point, Bona, the remote top 35, please vote for us. SMS <laughs> Simpiwe for Miss South Africa to 31314. <laughs> <laughs> Look how pretty you are. OMG. <laughs> have you seen yourself? You need to take yourself. I have seen beauty before, but this <laughs> is a discovery. <laughs> okay, focus. <laughs> hey, that's my playlist. Testing the lighting. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mm-hmm. 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 Look, Loza is here and she came with gifts. Look at her. She's like, you will see my arm. Loza, you're literally about to get into a photo shoot. Yeah. <laughs> Just come show them. Are you scared of the camera? Look, it's chemistry from YouTube. I know YouTubers. being naked now because Shibe is done with me. Yes. She <laughs> and she still has two more models to go. Zia Kala for real. We're gonna look at the photos and see what we have produced. Sorry, uh, I keep on interrupting. No, 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 don't worry about it. I'm very curious to see what the photos came out like. So, yeah, I'm not very confident in front of the camera or anything. <laughs> Listen to her laughing in the background. It really, like, it's it's the most awkward and funniest thing. And I keep giving Shibe the weirdest faces in between poses because I'm going through a lot mentally whenever I take pictures. But now is the moment of truth. It is the moment of honesty. Oh, is, is your name. Oh, oh, you are my my theory. Ow, ow, ow. When I. Our God is good like that. Hey! I'm not going to get out of here. I'm not going to get out of here. I'm not If I had a dollar for every time they said God wasn't gonna come through, I'd be. And my boob is escaping. Let me get dressed. It's Tabs from class. It's OMG. Tabs. He really is Shiba's cousin. Isn't that crazy? Tabiso is cousins with my friend. Ooh, who's that pretty girl? Oh my god. She's so pretty. Or give me up. No, again. <laughs> Yeah, no. no, I think yeah, no, this girl's just pretty. Oh my word. Oh my gosh, perfect. You know, dude, shocking. Yeah. Why not you bump by your baby cousin nonsense? My baby cousin. I mean your more, more my niece. <laughs> <laughs> that if the child is confident, the child is confident. Yeah, don't crush it. Don't crush the children. You're not sure. You're not liking yeah, any of the pictures. I'm also not sure. 
Hmm. Both me and Shiba. Shiba and I are very critical individuals. We were testing the lighting. <laughs> oh, that's a beautiful one. One thing about Jones. herself. This little guy. Uh, yeah. Mbolaye. <laughs> 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 it's like, kill me dead. I think it's nice. Ish. For makeup. For the makeup. Yeah. For the makeup. What was? Get For the makeup. For makeup purpose. Because we're not romantic and chumiyake. Yes, like, yeah. Look at it. We're not portrait in 19. My grandmother used to be a beauty queen. <laughs> Mm, my grandmother used to be a beauty nice. queen. It's nice. Yes. Really? And she's more yeah. No, this one is the other one that we both like. And it's this sleeping one? I <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? She said you have to go back one more. She's a cute I like your smile. You like my baby teeth? I like your smile. Thank you so much. I like you so yeah. Ooh, Zia Carla. Yeah. <gasps> so you just do the next pose. I'll probably do it. Okay. Oh, <gasps> come on. Oh, take away the the blinds. Yo, yo, yo. Only at dot z a. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Here. Did you did no, you see? No, 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 no. Did you see? See now we are busy struggling here with this. I have to sit with Beyonce. 90 pictures. Beyonce, okay, Beyonce. Anything for you, my queen. Uh, I've, I'm playing I'm playing Beyonce right now because you asked. Joey! Yo! B! It's your boy! Ah, you ready? What's up? Beyonce! Hey, bro! Shekala! <laughs> History in the making! Bona! Ah, look so, so good in your eyes. Hi, bo! Hi, bo! Look at the problems. We don't know if we want the one closed. Do you open? Or open? Or closed? Maybe closed. Yeah, I was also considering closed. I think closed. Yo, how does it feel to be so hot? I know, I'm going to be blessed. Yo, this one. You see this one, ne? This is the money maker. This one is the reason why we're gonna be rich one day. Yo, yo, yo. We picked our final five. Show the people what we have. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Guys, please look. I give Shiba so much stress. She's got. She's got presets in my name. Boy. Bex 1, Bex 2, Bex 2021, Bex 2022. Hey guys, if there's one thing about Bex, she will always have KFC. No, there's a week. KFC. There's a week that doesn't pass by without her having this bag. Dumped wings. It's just the dumped wings. I promise. I don't eat chicken. I only eat dumped wings. Are you sure? But you always have the bag. We don't know what's in the bag. All I'm saying. All I'm saying is, we don't know what's in this bag, okay? What's the one? Literally my first love, the dumplings. You also have the chicken noodles so well. I, I don't have dumplings. I'm, I'm scorched. <laughs> so basically, me, I'm just saying. <laughs> <laughs> this girl's like, we're just gonna act natural. We're gonna act like this conversation is just. Right now, okay, she's gonna summarize. She's gonna summarize my last video in 10 seconds. Let's go. All right, so basically, uh, Bex has been having imposter syndrome and she feels like people are putting her within a box. Yes. So, I'm just saying that it's time for her to actually show her true self without actually letting people put her in that box that she is, which is the calm, the whole self. yeah, the whole self basically, the loud and the calm person. Yes. So, I oh, think, did you see that guy? What happened? Oh. Oh, oh no. someone fell with the bicycle. He literally was like, he like fell onto the road and the bicycle with him. <gasps> that was so scary. I thought he was gonna die. But he's about to go. He did you. And he said, dust myself. What's he? <laughs> Back to what I was saying is that we need to allow people to accept the whole of Obabra. 
Because you've seen me on days where I'm yeah, not. Yeah, no. Like, I'm she is so calm. Jumpy. Like, she is so calm. And there are days where she's very jumpy. In there. But most of the time, I'm eating dung things. Like, KFC. <laughs> KFC. Most of the time. That's the only thing that this girl has on her hand. Every single time when I see her. It's so That's spanked. the most consistent thing in my life. KFC, dung things. Everything else. But you've got 20 seconds to say what you were saying to me. One of the things that she mentioned was that's probably why you're finding it so difficult to chill in the streets because yeah. even with guys like oh yes that's the conversation that we're yes, having that's yes that's the conversation we're having even that, with guys they come with a preconceived notion of like my personality and the kind of person that i am which like isn't me a hundred percent of the time exactly you literally only see the highlights on social media but yeah but we're not complaining we're not fighting are we we are not fighting I think obviously the video that you watched today was the one hour hundredth video where I was explaining like this whole situation and imposter syndrome and all the different battles that I face. It just so happens to be the conversation we were having in the car because we literally just had an experience I where think it's the conversation we've just been having a movie. Oh yeah, actually. <laughs> yeah! What hey, a fun day. This hand will literally be one person who will hype you up. Like, me? Yeah. One thing about me, I will she eat will... dunk drinks and I will hype you if up. If you're ever down, <laughs> yo, like you just come. This one will be your number one hype star. Only, only if I'm well fed. If I'm hungry, I'll probably be. Barbara's always here and then she comes down afterwards like so. <laughs> so, anyway. Anyway. <laughs> I'm like, wait, what? I definitely am on drugs. But yeah. Good night. Hi. I'll see you tomorrow at school. Yeah, you definitely can. Maybe. I'll call you when I'm home. I'm going I don't know if I want to go to school. Going all the way to Joba, guys. Ah! <laughs> Bye, Barbara. <laughs> it's this just you. Safe. You don't have what? stuff with your bags, nothing. No, this wow. is me. It's down. <laughs> the comment of the week goes to...